Hey guys, my name is Zabel, and today we're gonna to be checking out Wano's um part two of his of the the first mini album called Love Synonym Number Two. Right for us album. Um I'm really excited to check out um make sure this is there we go. Um I'm really excited to check out more Wano's um music. I really enjoyed the first album that he released. Um or the first part of the first mini album that he released and I'm really excited to check out what this um second mini album sounds or second part of this first mini album sounds like. So if you guys are excited make sure to like the video. Comment down below any of the songs from this second part that you enjoy. Subscribe, hit the bell so you be notified when my videos go live and for any extra content check out the Patreon. But without further ado the songs we're checking out are this music video called Lose and then we have two color coded lyrics called Devil best shot and then we have a special clips for the next song called we need and then we have a music video for the next song called ain't about you featuring kira um kira and then the last um songs are color code lyrics being flash and then the lose english version um and then is the last thing is an outro um called and so outro and um but um yeah, without further ado, let us um get into this. This man should not be in no damn water. <laughs> Just being honest, should not be in no water. I mean, for good reasons too, like, like my God. Like, you see what I mean by you should not be in no order. Ooh, I like how that sounded with that. I don't really like that because of how different the vocal is. Dang, she got him at gunpoint. I'm going to pause it here, but I really enjoy that. Like how he sings that is so different from the rest of like, you know, the rest of the tone and everything is really just different with the tone, but it really adds a lot, like a detail there. And I'm just like, oh my God, like, you know, she's about to shoot him. I like the aesthetics of the music video. Um, I don't know. I have not been reading the subtitles at all, but I mean, we're going to be checking out the English version anyway. So that should still give me like, you know, what is going on in the song. But um, I feel like from just the music video and just hearing, I know I'm going to lose, like, that this person is, has the control over them and that they, you know, no matter what they do, they just already are going to lose to them. Like, even if they try to get out the relationship or try to do this or that, they're just going to always lose because they can't fight maybe not, like, going against them or they love them so much, that kind of feeling. But we'll, we'll figure it out. I really like the music video. Love the choreo bits. I mean... Don't put this man in water if you don't want, you know, to pass out. That's what I'm just saying for for all you guys and girls out there watching this with me. Don't put this man in water. So here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. I am jealous, but it's like he worked for that too. Like, so that's why I'm like, like, wow. Like, you know, I'm jealous, but I'm happy for him. Like, I need to, I need to start doing work on me.
Oh my god, the amount of things that they're doing in this music video and the effects that he has to do, go through. Hey, 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 the footwork was so clean. I don't want to lose. Mmm. Don't want to lose. We don't want to lose. I really like that. I really like that song a lot. Um... <laughs> A very nice song. I really enjoyed the song a lot. It was a very nice, well, like, film music video. I really enjoyed the choreo. I just really like the sound of the song, too. Like I said, I really love that detail. Blues, like, that part it was really good. So, moving on to the next song, which is called Devil. So, we've got three, two, one, let's go. I'm gonna pause it here. Um, now I'll put down the punishment that is you. I'll leap down into hell. Ooh, <laughs> I like that line a lot. But I really like, um, it's called devil and says X is a devil. Like, is it talking about maybe the person that they used, that he used to be with is like the devil, like just evil. Like you brought out the good and evil together within this, within him. And like, he's leaving the punishment, which is her away and going deeper into hell. That's what he said, but. <laughs> I don't think I was paying well enough attention. I mean, to be honest, I was lost in so I felt like I was in a trance. The way this beat is going and the way his voice is, it feels like they're putting you into a spell. So, I mean, I wouldn't, I'm not surprised that I got lost into the song, not really paying attention to the lyrics as much. But I mean, I was like, I was like going, like I was, I felt like I was being hypnotized. 
But I mean, in a good way. Like, I really like the song. I really like his voice in this. Different tone, you know, showcasing a different side of him. Really like it. So, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. But yeah, there you have it. That has been Wano's Devil. I really enjoyed this song a lot. Like I said, put me in like a bit of a trance. I got lost with the lyrics. So you guys can let me know um, if you guys want to about this song and what the meaning of it is. But I really enjoyed this song. Really enjoyed his vocals. Just the different um, style and tones that he chose for this song. It was really cool and different. So here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Moving on to the next song, Best Shot. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. Hit me with the best. Most like I want to make your verses hit my groove is amazing. Marijuana's groove would be amazing, like, and like I like the comments, like you hit me with your best shot. I'm gonna pause it here, but um, like I said, I really enjoy this song. This beat a lot. I really like the lyrics. It's like basically like you know, baby, try me, tr you know, hit me with your best shot. Like you know, try to get with me. And if you want, you know, to get with me, you just grab my hand, follow me. Like basically, like you know, I'm. And I mean, he is that man. Like you know, you got to hit him with your best shot to get with Wana. You know, or you even have a chance. And it's like I like it. I like the confidence. Like the um, lyrics a lot, like once the light out, I'll, you know, show you my moves, basically show you how amazing I am. But, you know, you got to show me how amazing you are, too. So I really like that. Like I'm hitting you with my best shot. So show me your best shot. So here we go. Three, two, one, let's go.
But I mean, there you go. There's best chat. I really enjoyed the groove of that song. Like, I can just see Wano just dancing to this and just impressing whoever he's trying to impress with this, um, with his groove and his dancing. Like, it's just easy for him. But I really enjoyed the song. I really enjoyed the energy and just you know the feel of the song. But moving on to the next song, so we got three, two, one, set. Um, we need a special clip. So I found this on. I'm assuming that this is like. I think his personal channel, basically. Like, you know how idols have like maybe personal channel channels. So I was like, yeah, let's watch this. I'm pausing. I like that line. When I'm back on the stage and I sing this song, will you be there for me again? Oh, I like this. I like this song. Just and it's called "We Need." Basically, like we need each other. You and I need each other, and we'll be forever and ever. Like you know, I promise. Just you and I promise. You know, just all these things that we'll do. Like how the sky and the stars need each other. Um, the you know when the universe, like everything, like those connections is what we need. I like that, and I really like that they're kind of just driving, singing. The, he's singing this song. I didn't. I I think it's full English, all of it. So that's really cool. And it's just like just this fits the mood so well. How it's about to become nighttime and everything. Like, such a nice mood of a song. It like it fits very well. I really like the song. I really like his um, vocals on this song too, and the beat a lot. So here you got three, two, one, so. <laughs> I don't know who that was playing with him, but that was a cool person to have next to. I like this song, Sunglasses. But that was a nice, sweet song. I really enjoyed that a lot. But um, moving on to the next song, which is Ain't About You featuring Kira. So here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Kira. Let's 
still love you. And you get to see like both perspectives, like the woman and the man perspectives of like the other one. Not them, but they're kind of talking about it. Or ever, I like that. I like her um, voc her vocals so much. I wonder if he ever met Kira for this song, like, you know, like when did this come out? A year to COVID, yeah, still during COVID time, so. Uh, I wish they could have made the video together, like been together. Okay, well, you need to calm down. I like the outfits. I like her outfit, I like his outfits, all the different types of outfits that they had going, like changing through. But I really like the song because it's like, it's called Ain't About You. Like this person that, you know, can tell you about this, but can't tell you where they, they, they can stay up to 4 a.m., but they can't tell you like where they've been, what they've been doing. Like, you know, like, you know, you need to get this um shit through your head. It ain't about you. You know, it's about, us together but if you think if you keep things all about you you know there's you're wrong and, and i mean they're probably just saying like goodbye at this point too like this ain't about you like basically it's like stop stop playing these games this this is not about you you know <laughs> like i like it though so here we go three two one i like her vocal too <clears throat> i love it when they have like you know uh, idol works with a western artist because Discover someone else new. I really like her vocal. It's cool. Like, get this sorry or I miss you out my face. Like, like I don't want you anymore, Phil. Because it ain't about you. You keep playing these games. like Kira's texting him and then it's like the opposite it's like he's like texting her calling her like you know I like it though because they're you know showing that perspective and I really like that this ain't about you I really like that that was a nice song I really enjoyed that song I really like the music video with it too um got to see who Kira, Kira was Kira um was Kira Kira you know, um, but moving on to the next song, which is called Flash. So here we got three, two, one, let's go. <clears throat> Ooh. 
ponto. Olha essa. I'm gonna pause it here, but yeah, I really like the feeling of the song. Um, I feel like it's talking about maybe this love that, like, you know, that he gave up, but now he wants back, and he only maybe see flashes of it, like, like almost like a like a camera flash of the love, those moments and everything. It's like, I will see more than enough and I have to give back so much more. And it's like, it maybe regrets giving up his love, like realizing that he received a lot more it from this person than he maybe thought. And he has to maybe give back more, even so much more just to maybe have a chance of getting them back that they didn't realize it. Like, um, you know, so it's just like, it's just, yeah, and I like the emotion that Wano creates with his vocal and just how, um, just, just, I really like the beat a lot for this song. It's really cool. Here we go, 32 on the side. Maybe uh, maybe I was lost in the lyrics too. <laughs> you guys, oh, why does this happen sometimes? You guys will let me know. So um, you guys will let me know. But I really enjoyed the song. Like I like the emotion and just everything. But let us um move on to the next song. So here we got three, two, one. So this is the last song before we get to the outro. Lose English version. Lately, 
Instant game of love, yeah. Like, like no matter what he does, like he knows he's not supposed to do any of this, but he, he just can't, can't let you walk away. here but yeah like i thought like or like i was thinking but it's confirming like basically like this person's playing game with the the way of this game of love that this person's playing with them it's just like it's just this complete maze of mischief and everything and it's like he knows that he he doesn't want to play this game he doesn't want to talk he doesn't want to fight with this person but they, you just can't send them away. You can't send them away because he loves them too much. He loves this like game of love. He loves he loves this person way too much for them for him to give them give them up. Like it's it's impossible. Basically, it's too hard. So I really like that it's emphasized and just like that emotion of like you know you're supposed to not be with this person. You know deep down, but it's just like you you just can't you can't give it up. So, yeah, here we go. Three to one, so. <laughs> Look how, it, like, he has that note just starts descending. Really, it's so nice. I don't know what instrument that was. If that was, like, a violin, but I love it. <laughs> if, it if it is that. I didn't even notice that in the original song, that violin. You! I can do Don't want to lose, but you know you're gonna lose at this. But it's probably what he's telling. Him, don't want to lose. Oh, oh, thank God, I didn't click. Oh, but um, there you have it for the lose English version. I really enjoyed the song and listening um through it a second time. It felt like we were like doing a just a reaction to the um actual just like a release of of a Wano song where we go back and replay it. Cause I got to hear the violin. I got to hear like the, like the grand, like rising of the song and descending of the song. And like that lose part was very nicely well um, sung. But um, yeah, um, we're at the end of the album with the outro, just gonna let this play all the way out. Cause it's only a minute and 34 seconds long, but it's called Outro Answer. You got three, two, one, let's go. Very nice album. I really enjoyed this album a lot. Very cool album.
I don't know why I feel so emotional for this. I don't know why I just got emotional for that last, for the outro, but it's just like their friends are waiting for you. There's been like a bunch of these love songs and everything. So yeah, I really enjoyed that album a lot. That was a very nice album from them. Um, I really enjoyed like just all the different love and just all like the lyrics and the fun songs that he had and some more of like the emotional serious songs and just him just really getting in with his um voice and tones and vocals was really nice. Um, I really enjoyed the title of Blues. The title track is so good. I really enjoyed it. But um, with that, um, my top three B-sides would have to be Ain't About You, We Need, and Best Shot. I really enjoyed those three the most. Um, but yeah, that is the end of the um of his of the second part of his first mini album. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed this. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my reaction to this. Um, like I said, let me know about any songs from this album that you enjoyed. And yeah, I'll see you guys for the next video. Bye.